What is up guys, it's Risky here. Welcome back to another Call of the Wild video on my channel here today. In today's video, I have some really exciting news for you all. We have the official announcement of the brand new reserve coming to Call of the Wild. Probably gonna really butcher the pronunciation of the reserve, but I'm gonna try my best. Tiarora, Tiarora or something like that. I, I can't really understand it. I know they say it in the trailer, but it's just hard for me to say that. I don't, I'm assuming I just, I don't know how to say those kind of words, okay? Maybe if one of you guys want to help me, maybe try and like put it in a, like sound it out for me in the comment section and help me pronounce it. I speak American, so not very good at these kind of things. But yeah, we have a brand new map, Tiawara <laughs> National Park. Hell, I might even be saying it right. I don't know, but I don't think I am. Really exciting. It looks really good, honestly. The animals look super cool. The map looks beautiful. If you want to check out the official trailer for yourself, I'll leave a link to that in the description. Looks awesome. Really excited to see this map coming to the game. Finally, something new. Kind of getting a little bored of everything else uh, and just getting bored of Call of the Wild in general. We have something new here, so that's great. So I went through the trailer, wrote down as much information as possible. I know they live streamed or something like that. I think the same day that the trailer came out. Didn't watch the live stream. There might be some information in there that I missed out, but I'm not going to go over that. If there's anything that you guys know that I don't, that I don't go over in this video, hey, let me know in the comment section. I'd be happy to hear it. Maybe we can help each other out. But this is just information that I gathered from the trailer, such as, you know, maybe a little bit about the what kind of land we're going to be able to see on this map where this map is based the release date and all of the animals that we're going to be seeing so enough rambling let's get straight into this so the Tiawara <laughs> national park is based in new zealand i'm not even going to try and pronounce that anymore i'm just going to say the new reserve instead of Tiawara or however the hell you say it but it's based in new zealand a lot of you guys said that in one of my most recent videos that you probably think that this map is going to be based in new zealand and that was one of my guesses as well and hey look we're right there's gonna be a lot of different terrain on this map such as really big mountains that we can traverse open fields and also some like beach forest things that i'm going to show you a picture of right here in the trailer they describe this as a beachy forest looks beautiful you can see some animals there in the background just having a a little sip of water and all that good stuff very beautiful looking picture there so there's going to be a good bit of variety in this map if you ever want to go up in the mountains and hunt some animals you can go up there if you want to stay down in the open flatland kind of deal you can stay down there there's a lot of options we have seven species coming to this map at least two to three of them are animals that we have already seen we are getting some kind of rabbit species i'm not exactly sure exactly what kind of rabbits but in the trailer they didn't describe it they literally just said rabbit uh, we're gonna be getting red deer chammy chamoy i'm not too sure how to pronounce that feral goats feral pigs rabbits fallow deer and sicka deer super excited for the sicka deer and honestly, my favorite one out of this whole list is the feral pigs. I've been really wanting a new pig species added to the game. We've had the wild boar and all that stuff forever. And I think feral pigs are just going to be really, really cool. They were one of my favorite things to hunt in the Hunter Classic. I'm excited to see how they're going to work in this game. I'm really excited to be able to get out there and hunt some new animals. This is awesome. I've been, like I said, I've been getting bored of the stuff that we have now. And this is awesome to finally see something new. Let me know your favorite animal species out of this list in the comment section below. We have some great news as well, but it's also kind of worrying regarding like the last release of Silver Ridge Peaks. We all know when that ma map came out, there was quite a handful of bugs. The map was kind of laggy. You could just see like the map grid off in the distance. It just wasn't, it didn't feel 100% completed. Hopefully we don't come into that same issue with this map. I'm really crossing my fingers on that, but this map, the release date is set for December 10th. That is only in, uh, what, nine days from the time I'm making this video. So right around the corner, we're going to be receiving this map. It should be out on all consoles or all platforms, it says. So that's Xbox One, PS4, and Steam on PC, obviously. And I think they have it on the new, new gen consoles, like the Xbox Series X or whatever, and the PS5. I, I don't even know if they have Call of Duty on those yet, but I could be wrong. So I'm really hoping they have a really solid release bug free hopefully this map runs good hopefully the animals are working not getting my hopes up though because you know expansive worlds has uh, definitely had some trouble with releases in the past if you've uh, been playing for a while you wouldn't know what i'm talking about but anyways there you go tiawara i'm not too sure if i'm saying that right again the brand new new zealand national park map seven new animals beautiful landscape to hunt and it's coming out on december 10th probably going to be about eight dollars i believe which is how much every other map dlc costs so 
there you go. If I get any more news before the map is released that I feel like is important to share with you guys, I will definitely make a video on it and let you all know. Thanks so much for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. It helps me out a bunch, and I'll see you all in the next one. Later.